APNU presidential candidate Brigadier David Granger might have said that he saw no signs of voter apathy today. However, in Region 3, voting was slow. On elections, the officials said that by noon, voter turnout between Rheinzeck and Zealot was just over 33%. At the St. John's Primary School, Anna Katharina, one poll clerk confirmed this. Now, we have noticed about the turnout so far. Very poor so far. At, At least day. our section. Uh -huh. But there was a steady trickle of voters. At Shortville, the situation was slightly better. But by noon, hardly anyone was turning up to vote. Things have been going slow, slow for now, because there has been laps between, in between. Because, um, you know, earlier it was kind of busy, but we've got a relaxation now. Probably with the persons will turn up a little more in the afternoon. It was the same thing at Cornelia either, and at Diamond East Bank Demraro, where the secondary school accommodated over seven polling stations, things were slow. The observers who turned up had precious little to monitor. And Elections Commission Chairman Dr. Steve Surridge Bally reported that he had cause to sack two GCOM staff members. They had issued tendered ballots. Tendered ballots don't count at the polls. We have had on occasion instances where our own staff uh, have lapsed. Uh, unfortunately, we were firing them immediately. So they have been removed from their positions uh, for uh, express totishness. It is very clear what a tendered ballot is there for, by law. But when you see the first four persons go into the polling station and they are issued a tendered ballot, you know something is wrong. Parvati Ganga Pasad, who was working at the Glasgow Nursery School, was one of those dismissed. She had issued nine tendered ballots to voters. The other was Pamela Mutu, who was working at the Eversham School. She issued 10 tendered ballots. Adam Harris, Prime News.